Yeah. Going live. Why? Why have you got to go live on the stream? You know, sometimes I like to go on Twitch and just play video games because they're fun. And I don't know why, but I just do it anyways. Just for the lulls, as people say. What's up, everybody? We are uh, live streaming Broadbrain here with our buddy Red. Yeah, well, you're live. I'm like live miles and miles away. Yeah, you you are you're live, but you're not here. Yeah, I am not seated in that comfy chair seated right next to you. Right here. That looks like a very comfortable chair he sits in. Yeah, it probably is. I never get to sit in it. You should. Scoot over. He isn't. He isn't. Be, no. Be naughty. No. What's he going to do? No. What's he going to do? He's going to find out. He's, he's gonna not going to be good. He's going to hit you with his suit of armor hand? Come on. Probably. He probably up, would. Throw down the gauntlet. He probably would. He, he would probably literally throw down his gauntlet. Or slap me in the face with it or something. I, I have no idea. And Tranda uh, says hello or sup, man. And Tranda, um, also, I think I know who that is. Um, also a, a new follower to the, the channel, so thank you. Welcome. Enjoy yourself while you are here. A um, little bit different show because Ike's not here, so, uh, yeah. Doesn't help, but we got Red here. I, I, hope, I, can, place. I hope I can fill his armor. I think he can. Well, you might not be able to. He, I think he drinks more beers than you do. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's I'm the case. Positive, that's the case. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm like ninety nine point nine eight percent positive that that's the case. I've seen him drink one beer, so that makes it me one hundred percent positive. There you go. That's all you need. So. It's great. It's a good time. Well, we might as well uh, get into it because, uh, you know, we have people watching. And yeah. uh, why would we deprive them of the majestic beauty that is 1001 Spikes? Those spikes are not going to impale themselves. No. No. They they need me to do that for them. So I have, I've actually made it to stage three on this. Um, I don't think, I think I had like one viewer when I was doing this before, but it saw me die many, 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 many times. So I don't know how bad I'm going to be tonight, but I'm, uh, I must say I'm thoroughly enjoying the graphics. Yeah, it's, it's all old school. 8-bit graphics. That That's like my favorite right there. Okay, so that's... Okay, and that's throw. Oh, God. Well, there there we go. There's, there's death number one. No. Okay. That's good. Oh! Damn it! <laughs> yeah, and, and there's number three. Okay. All right, I gotta focus here. So, anyways, how's how's life been going in uh, Nuevo York? Uh, not too badly. Um, just been living it up. Uh, now this warm out, I'm actually outside jogging and getting oh, fit. Sweet. Yeah, I'm I'm physically fit. I uh, I have a garden out front of the house now with flowers that I'm taking good care of and then uh, around the corner there's a community garden that I'm gonna be starting to plant vegetables in sweet dude it's good time so are you are you developing your green thumb as they say yes well, I, I've always had the green thumb I just never got a place to put it oh being outside was such a an issue for me before right exactly all right I'm hoping this thing doesn't shoot at me Ow! Okay, all right, we're good. All right, so that's, that's, okay. Oh, God. 
Oh boy. Oh, that's that's not so good. Wow. I gotta make it a considerable way. Okay, I can jump there if I time it right. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be brutal. Yeah, I'm a little bit behind you. This this is just doesn't look like any fun at all. It's it's a challenge. It's a challenge that's fun on it. That that's what makes it worthwhile. Ah! I went like a second friggin' too early, and that was that was the death of me. Alright, so aside from navigating this horrible, horrible spike-filled maze, what what's your objective? Um, are there collectible things or? Yeah, so there's there's a skull in every level that you want to collect, and um, oh, if you need you a skull. It, yeah, just, if you collect it, just you pick up your own dead skull after you jump in the spikes like ten times. Well, I wish it. Plenty of skulls. I wish it would stay there. Is it that blue glowy thing that's up there? The skull? Uh, no, that's the key. You have to oh. get that too to unlock the door for the end of the level. Oh, I was over just a little bit too far. No, no, no. And are, I'm assuming there's also enemies you have to, to fight, or else you would be able to throw daggers. Yes. Well, and not only that, but there's certain traps that you have to use your daggers for. Hmm. Oh God. Well. Man, that is always a brutal jump. Okay, so if I wait there... Oh! Oh, I am screwed now. Ah! <laughs> I almost had it. Oh my god. Yeah, so the lungs are holding up. No problems there. You're good. Yeah, yeah. Everything's wonderful. It sounds like it. Yeah, hanging out with all my friends. Um, probably doing some bocce ball this weekend. Sweet. The old Italian sport of choice. I'm not sure if it's fully... I know a lot of Italians play. I'm not sure if it was originated in Italy or... Ah! Sicily or... Yeah, I'm not exactly sure where it originated. I could Wikipedia, but uh, I'm lazy. Yeah. Also, my keyboard is very loud, so I won't even type. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot you have the, the clickety-clack keyboard that you work with. Yep. Yep. I literally typed pooped four, four times right, right there. Just P-O-O-P, P-O-O-P. Poop, 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 poop. Poop, 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 poop. Fifty, fifty, fifty. Boy, boy, boy. Ah! No! <laughs> Okay, there's something I'm not figuring out with that block there. The, the wobble one? Yeah, the one that keeps going out on me. Something I'm just not seeing. I just want to cut through, <laughs> through here. Oh my goodness. This does not look pleasant even after I get through this. Again, it's like an ancient, uh... It, it's... It's like an ancient, uh, you know, ruin, so... Yeah, it looks like, like Aztec or Mayan. It, it, it wouldn't, um... It wouldn't be pleasant. That would, like, defeat the whole purpose of it.
is the ruins of Ukampa. Oh, I keep telling that jump wrong now, too. Bachi's pretty old, old, actually. I'm looking it up on my phone. It was uh, developed in the Roman Empire. Really? Yeah. So it is. It is Italian. It, it is Italian, but it's, you know, predates Italy. It's, it's Rome. Roman. Yeah. But it, it's expanded all over the world as, as Italy has migrated. There's Australians and North Americans and South Americans that all play it. Oh my god! Oh, I almost had it. It's very popular in Croatia, Montenegro, and Herzegovina. 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 The Slavs, they love it. This is a Slavish sportive choice. Well, I, I uh, got back from Peru, um, not last week, but the week before, I think it was. And, How'd that go? Uh, let me tell you, I like it down there. It, it's pretty awesome. You've told me stories of how great it is. It's just the traffic. Yeah. The traffic sucks. You just go to Santiago, you didn't go, or you went to Peru, right? Yeah, I went yeah. to Peru. So Santiago was in Chile. Peru, you went to Lima? Lima, yep. Good folks there. It's cheap, too. That's why... That That's the other thing that I like about it. Yeah, that's what I've heard. My friends, uh, Mark and Geraldine, they like to travel a lot, and uh, they go down to South America sometimes, and they just love it because it's so cheap in comparison to up here. Oh, yeah. Well, the markets are fun, you know, you can negotiate with guys, and um, you can say, hey, you know, I'll, I'll give you 33 soles for the $35 chair, and... You know, well, I got this little stool, right, um, to put next to my chair. Okay. And it was like 30, 35 soles, which is about 12 bucks US. And so I go and I say, well, would you, would you take 30 for it? And the guy's like, well, I'll take 33. So it's like 11 bucks US. Nice. So it wasn't really much of a discount, but it just made me feel better that I wasn't paying full price for it, I guess. I don't know. Well, it's like when you go to the estate sales. You can always haggle your way. Oh my god. Oh, I made it! Okay. Oh my god. All right, how am I gonna get, oh. Oh, wow. Okay, um, interesting. This is gonna suck. So there's no like save point halfway through the level? Nope. No checkpoints, no save points. Just screw you points. Yep. This thing is going to shoot at me. I don't know. Oh, God. Oh, God. I I just get a bad feeling about this. Okay. So no, no spikies there. Um. All right. How am I going to do this? Okay, I can't break any of those. I'm pretty sure those are going to disintegrate. Oh! 
Oh, no. I'm making progress, though. I haven't seen the death yet, so. Oh, my God. It's, it's tragic. I waited for Oh. About... I didn't know those claps. That's, that's terrible. Yeah. That's terrible. Well, the problem is, in this game, you really have to assume that anything that you see on the screen is going to kill you, even though it doesn't look immediately obvious. At least I got to the one up. If I get to the one up, then if I lose a life, I don't feel so bad. <clears throat> oh. Damn it. <laughs> See, I'm a lot calmer if I get if I get to that skull, I'm fine. You know, I'm I get frustrated after, like, the 50th time, but, um, Ugh. it's, it's really a game of patience a lot of times. Kind of like, it's kind of like Super Meat Boy. You got, you yeah. got to, you can't keep your nerves down. Because if you try to hurry yeah, yourself you, too much, you screw it up. Yeah, you can't, you can't let yourself screw up because, oh, God. Um, you just can't let yourself get upset and angry. You just have to go and just keep calm and say, okay, everything's going to be fine. No worries. Okay. Got there. The civilization that built these ruins really didn't want their skulls being pilfered. No, they didn't. They hid them quite well. Behind rocks, next to keys. In rooms filled with spikes that protrude fast back and forth. And flame spitters and disintegrating blocks. Damn it. And 2D platforming. Well, you always have to have 2D platforming. If you're going to build ruins, you need to have 2D platforming for, for the ruins. Maybe that's where the Incans and the Aztecs went wrong. They did those three dimensional pyramids. That's it right. Should have went 2D. You really. You need to go 2D. The that's Spanish. Buy a lot. The Spanish knew how to master the 2D. That's why they won. That's right. Conquistador is Spanish for 2D. Oh, I, you know, I did not, and I speak, you know, Spanish pretty well, so. It's a rough translation. Oh, oh okay. Oh, I gotcha. I Con see what you're laying down. Conquist 2D door. 2D door, okay, see. Now that makes a lot more sense. So I'm j I'm just going to try to go the next time I get there and see what happens. Condostidor? Dos de door. I don't know. It might work. So for uh, the last several weeks, I've been going to a trivia at various places around the area. Uh, yeah. called, my, called my friends, yeah. Uh, we were at uh, this place called Shenanigans. Oh, that's up on uh, the boulevard, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Every, and every time yeah. we drive in there, we, we, we do the line from uh, Super Troopers. But, well, um, you have to. Uh, 
I'm pretty good at trivia, as you you probably know. Well, it, yesterday, just destroyed. I just destroyed. I killed everybody. Oh my god! I almost had it. Oh. They they had topics about MMORPGs, uh, '80s uh, bands, uh, mythological creatures. These are all things I know everything about. Dude, oh, yeah, you got seriously. burned. You got burned. You died. Yes, I did. That sucked. Dude, I almost had it too. I did not know that that solid looking block that was there was gonna fall. No, of course not. I mean, that. When you look at that block and you see that and you play this game a lot, you're like, okay, yeah, that's solid. But they're changing up the rules on me. Yeah, clearly. And, it's like, it's and really, I, I had fallen into a false sense of security, you know, that's... That's how they keep you on your toes. Yeah. Well, I mean, it looks just like the block that, that you keep falling, that keeps breaking away when you stand on it. Yeah, that's true. That first although, big jump. although, if you look at those two, they look the same. I mean, if you look at the one below it, it it's the same thing. That's what I'm saying. It really is. So there's no way to really tell. It's a roll of the dice every time. Ah! There we go. Okay, that first one's easy. But yeah, sometimes you get frustrated at this game and it just winds up punishing you for getting frustrated at it. Much like Super Meat Boy, I guess. Yeah. I guess in that respect they are very similar. Oh my god! Just let me get to the skull every time. Come on. That, that, that's that's what I'm really asking for here. Just, just let me get to the skull. That's, that's really all I want. That, that was even worse. See, I'm getting worse. That's how I tend to be when I'm, pl be when I'm playing uh, Super Meat Boy is, I'll do for a while, while do, blah, blah, I'm doing okay for a while, and then I just hit a wall where I just can't do the simplest things. Yeah, and that's what, that's what sucks when you hit that wall. You're just like, Okay. So I'm at the good point, and... See, when we were kids, that's when we would say, you know, screw this, hit the reset button, pop in a new cartridge. Yeah, exactly. Screw me, Metroid! Really? Ah! It really didn't serve us well as, as adults. Oh my god. Beautiful. Oh my god. That I need a water break after that. Oh my Yay. god. That that was that was stage three one. How many stages are there in stage three? Is it like Mario? Uh, I believe it's like five and then like a bonus or something like that. It was like a boss stage. Yeah, kind of like that. Well, it, it's it's like an easy stage. You just go and you find this relic, and then after you find that, um, a, a boulder drops and you have to run. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Indiana Jones that, style. The the game would do that to you. By the way, it really would. It, it's that kind of game that it will just dick you in every single way possible. But when you die, it's your fault. It really is. I mean, yeah. it's just your fault. Um, that being said, 
Um, I look forward to those easy stages because you just go and you get like a relic and it gives you lives, which you really need. Wait, there's, there's lives in this game? Yeah, you get a, a thousand and one lives. Oh, I see. That sucks. And I predicted that I was going to lose about 250 tonight, so... Well, you're well on your way. Okay. I bet you... Yep, yep, that thing's going to shoot at me. Oh my goodness. Alright. Ooh. Okay, so I can do that. That's not a problem. All right, get up there. Oh, okay. Well, the skull's in a good place. I can, I can easily get to the skull without getting shot. So that's that's a plus. And I just died. <laughs> I just watched that thing just fall. Yeah, it's. I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. No. That's just bull, man. That's just complete bullshit. No. Oh! Oh! This game is just oh, evil. Man. It really is. Oh. <laughs> I can't. I can't get up there. Okay. Alright. So I made it that far. I got the skull, so all I need is a key. Now. I can't jump that, sadly. That would be fantastic if I could. My bet is that that thing is going to drop. Nope, it's not. So I have to time my drop right that... Oh! Okay. Well, that's easier than I thought. Alright. Good enough. Yep. Okay. Oh! Oh my god, that was cheap. Wait till you see this one. That, that... Oh my god. That was just horrendous. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. It's just standing there. Eh. Like that's what you get for just standing there, idiot. Okay. So this I'm not feeling too bad about. Nope. So all I have to do is just get on top of that. Get on top of that. Oh. Long jump. Okay, so I'm thinking that I'm gonna need that one to ride all the way back up. Oh god. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay. Yep, I am definitely going to need that other one to get back up, so... Oh my god. <laughs> that is not cool. And I know, this game is freaking brutal. Oh, oh. Eh! Okay. That's, that's good. <laughs> oh, boy. What triggered that to shoot the knife at you? Uh, proximity. Oh. Uh. Okay. I figured there wasn't a shortcut, but... You never know with this game. You really...
Okay, I'm gonna have to be faster on the jumps there. I don't know how I'm gonna do that, but... I'm not quite sure, man. This is... This is gonna be tough. Okay. Okay. There we go. There we go. Nope. Nope. That didn't do it. Okay. Alright, so we're up there. We're still plus 1,000 lives. Did you ever just call them, like, lives, or did you call them mans, or did you call, you know... I would just call them extra lives. It kind yeah. of bugged me when people said call them mans, because mans is not yeah. a... Pl it's not a... It's men. And even then, you're the same guy over and over again, so it's not like there's more yeah. of you. One... One thousand and one mans. <laughs> I have one thousand and two mans. You have a... Nope. A, a veritable nope. army of mans. Of... The mans. Remember the man show? Yeah, I do. Dude, that... That show was freaking amazing. I miss that show. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, the old guy that did the Ziggy Zoggy. Yeah, he passed, sadly. Yeah. Ziggy Zoggy, Ziggy Zoggy, hoi, hoi, hoi. <clears throat> okay, come on. And then Adam Carolla, who's still doing his Adam Carolla thing. Yeah, Adam... Adam Carolla could never, like, act, because he's just Adam Carolla. Yeah. In everything. Well, Jimmy Kimmel's Jimmy Kimmel no matter what he does. That's very true. He just puts the Jimmy Kimmel spin on it, and it, it's still funny. It is. Alright, so I'm wondering if I gotta do high jumps with those. Okay, that's easy enough. Yep. <clears throat> that that wasn't good. Have you watched any of that uh, new late late night guy, the guy who replaced Ferguson? No, is he any good? Me neither. I I haven't watched him. That's why I was asking. Oh, okay. I'm usually I'm usually out still at that point in time. I'm I'm kind of a night owl now. Yeah, you're you're a night owl guy. I mean, I've always been a night owl person, I just now have the ability to actually leave and go out. Yeah, and go out and do things and socialize and hang out with the peoples. Yeah, that's right. With them persons. Oh, uh, the other thing that I haven't watched is the uh, new Daily Show. Um, yeah, me neither. With that new guy. Okay. Oh, did you so, did you see the uh, uh, announcement ABC made? Yeah, uh, Muppet Show. Yeah. Um, I guess it's gonna be on Tuesdays. So it looks like I will not be streaming on Tuesday nights. Huh. I know they had an actual date lined up for it because usually my Tuesday nights are uh, Marvel Agents of Shield, but uh, I have that set to record. It doesn't start till nine anyway, but. Uh, yeah, tonight's the uh, season finale of that, so I'm looking forward to it. Oh my god. Oh, that that is cruel. That is just cruel. I mean, I, I've gone through a lot of stuff in this. But oh my god. That's, that's just... <laughs> how, are you, how are you even supposed to? What do you got to do there? Well, you're not supposed to jump first first thing, I guess, but... Well, that, that last death was just... I think if you that go... That was on you. That was all you. If you go... Yeah, if you go down... Then it's gonna get you. If you go up and don't jump up like I did, I think you're probably gonna wind up being alright, so... Mm, we'll see. The other thing that I'm severely worried about... Okay, so I'm fine there.
I guess I got the lives. It's just a pain to go through it again. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I could try it, but... What the hell was that? Seriously? I don't even know what killed me. I didn't I didn't hear anything. Oh, you got squished in between the wall and the moving pl platform. Really? Yeah. Oh, that that one was on me. That was horrible. Extra mounds. Looking forward to TwitchCon this year. That's going to be a good time. Yeah, you were speaking highly about it. I'm hoping. I don't know. Like, sometimes you have those events and they're not as good as you think they're going to be, but it's got to like, be. Like that one Ohio convention? Yeah, that we won't name. That well, it doesn't exist anymore. So, I wonder why. Yeah, well, that's it's a real shocker, right? Yeah, I, I felt bad I didn't go to Toracon this year. A lot of my friends went, and I just I don't know. I, I forgot it was coming up. I didn't buy a ticket and didn't go. But I heard it was a lot of fun. It was better than usual years. Yeah, some people complain about it, but they're... People complain about everything, uh, though. It's just everything. the culture. Yeah. Well, and that's what I hate. You know, people are just... They're they're not satisfied with anything anymore. I don't think they realize how hard it is to actually put something like that together. And all the hours and, and effort and contact they have to do with all the different guests. And, and then they, they chirp up and say they didn't like that one small little thing that so ruined the whole thing for them. Skull get. Oh God. But yeah, I, like like today, uh, and and I want to talk about this for a minute. Well, I've got a break. All right. As you'll see in a minute. Um. You know, the someone was talking that, I, and and I read a blog online, and it was it was about the whole, um. You know, Black Widow thing with the new Avengers movie, which I haven't seen, so no spoilers. Oh, oh okay, yeah. Um, well, I wouldn't spoil any because I don't know if any of your uh, viewers have seen it either. So yeah, it wouldn't I, be prudent. It wouldn't be prudent. Uh, Enter Nada, thanks for joining us, man. Enjoy. We'll uh, we'll see you next time. Um. So I don't I don't know what happened, but everybody's really you know, bitching about this whole thing. Um, like, with with everything. Well, and you're going to be more specific the, about what they're, they're angry at, because I don't know. I, well, well, I was I'm, fine I'm with not, The problem is that I'm not exactly sure what everybody's so mad about, because I haven't seen the movie. So, they're, they're mad about something in the movie that she was, like, downplayed or written out or something, you know, that... No, I, I, I really don't know. I mean, she, um, she didn't get a massive amount of screen time, but that's kind of hard to give her all that screen time when you're focusing also on Iron Man and the Hulk and Hawkeye and Quicksilver and Scarlet Witch and the Vision and and Ultron. There's so many people; it's going to be impossible to give them all equal amounts of storyline and have it be a good story. Oh, so, so they went and you know. There's a there's this blogger that and she goes and she was ranting about it and it's like well you know whatever there may be a legitimate concern I didn't see the movie. What I did see was Guardians of the Galaxy. I saw it twice. That's it. And well, that's it for right now. I I haven't uh, 
I haven't watched it more than that, but I saw it three times in theater and twice since it came out on DVD. Or I mean, Blu-ray. It's, it's a fantastic movie. I, I it certainly is. It. I thought it was fantastic. But they called um, Gamora, 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 Gamora. Drax called her, you know, a green whore. Yeah. And this this woman was bitching about that, you know, saying, "Well, the, that's sexist, and that shouldn't be in the movie, and everything." It's well, a group of assholes. Well, and, and, and you know what? I hate to break it to this person, but sexism is a real thing. It would be yeah. it'd be kind of stupid to have almost no realism to it whatsoever by not pointing out things that are each other's weaknesses. Well, and, and that's what I thought was so brilliant about the movie was the fact that it they were assholes. They were flawed. They oh, had yeah. they had major character flaws. You know, they weren't perfect. They weren't, you know, the stereotypical good guy superheroes like, well, I mean, Captain America was racist as hell, but, you know, that was fitting for that time, so. Right. Um, but the, the movie version it wasn't at all. Right, right, exactly. But y- you had this group of dicks, and, you know, Drax was undoubtedly in this prison for a long time. Yeah. And. I'm sure that they referred to her as the green whore because they were pissed at her. They're, you know, they want uncouth. They, they want to kill her. They're prisoners and they're uncouth. So you know, it's like, well, that shouldn't have been. I I can't believe that he allowed them to to write that into the script. And you know, women are forty percent of the comic audience, and I'm like, you know. You can't say anything anymore without somebody getting offended by it and causing a big stink about it. And there's some things that, yeah, you know what? You should probably be offended by that. But I think you got to pick and choose your battles a little bit more carefully, and that wasn't one to really pick a be- to, to pick yeah. a fight on, in my opinion. I agree. But... I thought it was just somebody going and, okay, yep, this is popular, and what angle can I put on it? Yep, great. Um, I'll do that so that I can... It doesn't matter what is portrayed by a female on screen. It's going to be sexism one way or another. Because you're going to have... Cause if they they are playing... A, uh, like let's take, let's take Brave, which... Yeah. You know, there, it was a, a great movie. It was about a female central character who had great morals... And, but yet, then you had women who are, are, are bashing the movie because they, they they she's too manly. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah. I thought she was a great role model. She was awesome. First of all, I mean, I I thought it was a great movie. I thought she was a great role model for girls. You know, yeah. It was I, I love Merida. She's one. She was one of the best written characters uh, that Disney's put out in a long time. Yeah. It, 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 she far and ahead destroys uh, what's her face from Tangled, Rapunzel. Yep. Not that Rapunzel was was bad at all. I, I think she was hilarious. Well, and, and welcome to welcome to Good is Evil, the Disney movie edition. Seriously. <laughs> hey Nate. Petit Petit do, Boulet. Do, do, do you want to build a snowman? No, I don't. I do, I never want to build a snowman ever, ever. Uh, I I don't like that movie, dude. I really. <laughs> I was okay. It's okay. It's, it doesn't deserve the hype it gets. It, as far as Disney movies are concerned, it's a Disney movie. It's no better than you know, Cinderella or, or Snow White. But uh, ooh, oh, ooh, here's, ooh. here's here's a topic of uh, ooh, that looks fun. Uh, of, of contention. Who is the hottest Disney princess? Hmm. If we're gonna get sexist here, let's go all, all in. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, we might as well, right? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh no. Oh. Oh, this is going to be painful. Okay, so all I have to worry about are those two. <laughs> oh my god. Why? Why is this game? Oh no. And I I have not found a skull yet. That is not good. Um, all right, so if, if we're going to go in, oh, well, well, that was my fault. That pushed me all the way through the floor that time. 
Okay. All right. Come oh. on, let there be a skull there. No. Nope. Okay, there's not one there. Oh, so now... At least okay, it's good to know so if you're in, a, in an emergency, there's... you really need to get through the floor. You can just get pushed through by a, by a yeah. falling block. You won't live yeah. through it, but... The, the, the problem was I died, and that that wasn't good. Um, As far as the hottest goes, man, I, I like Elsa as, as far as hotness goes. Okay. Um... Now, how expanded do we want to go on this? Oh, Disney! All of all, all of the, the chicks in Disney, like Jasmine and and Pocahontas. All right. Well, can can we go Jessica Rabbit then? Because she's Disney. Is she? Yep. Because because they, they all there was also shared with Warner I, Brothers as well. I th I always thought yeah. there was more of a Warner Brothers movie than Disney. Oh God, I ducked. I mean, okay. Well, Jessica, awesome. Jessica Rabbit aside, because that's I think should be everybody's default answer. Yeah. If if I mean, they're at all straight. I mean, come on, she's redhead. She's got a great body. Those lips, just oh. Yeah. Uh. I like I like Belle. Another yeah, fine choice. You know, she's one of them readers. Um. You know, got got some good intelligence. You know, Matt, I I find intelligence attractive. Oh yeah. Well, I am losing terribly here. Go! Oh god. Okay. Boy, this is this is just happy time frolics here. Okay, at least there wasn't a skull there. Uh, okay, there's a skull. Oh my god. Why? Why is the skull there? Why are you there? Why are you all the way up there? Because that's where they want you to go. Well, that is BS. And I am not happy about it. Oh god. Oh, I made it. <laughs> oh, I don't want to go down there. There's bad death and things there. Oh god. Oh god! Oh no, no! Oh no! Why? Oh. You just drowned down there or something. Yeah, I could have had that. That would have been, would have been all right. Okay. Now I can use those to crush Hulk Smash. If, if we are using all of Disney, I guess we could say Princess Leia would would technically qualify. Oh. Oh, that's that's good though. Yeah, that that wasn't good. Down. Left, right, left, right, BA start. Yep. That's what this feels like. Okay. Oh, God. But of the regular Disney princesses, I got a thing for Snow White. Yeah. Yeah, despite her her fetish for for you know dwarves, she is she is the fairest of them all. I mean, let's let's give her that. I like brunettes. So I, I, I like I like pale skin. She's got a nice sense of style. That's very true. I have to admit, you got a point. I mean, of course, then there's Ariel, a, a redhead. Who, who doesn't like redheads? And then, well, and a mermaid. On well, top I mean, of that. I don't know. The, the fish thing doesn't go for me. I, I'm not attracted to fish. No. 
No. Um, I eat fish. I don't want to sleep with one. Well, you know, to each his own. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I just learned a new trick. Oh, yeah? Yeah, if I shoot... If I shoot... Those spikes... Those rolling spikes... Oh, they go backwards. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. No! Oh, I should have just gone and been done with it. But no. I need... I need that skull. For my game will not be complete until I collect them all. <laughs> that was just not cool. They had that drop away like that. Yeah, I know. That's, you should have seen it coming. That's the thing. You should have seen that coming. Well, just because the game yeah. likes to do that to you. Nothing, nothing's ever as it seems. It, it's like, okay, what's the biggest dick move that I can do to this guy? Like, right here. Wait for that one to go. Oh, God. Damn. Oh, my God. You have 981 lives. Yeah, you know what? And the problem is, I see all of them, and it's like... Okay, I've got all these lives. I know that I'm going to lose them all. I know that I'm going to need, like, every single one of them. Oh, smash. And that really is the problem. Oh, God. Oh, you got close on that one spike. Is that one blade thingy? Just ran your heels. Okay, if I had just let that go, that would have been fine. Why didn't I do that? Because I'm an idiot. Okay, yeah, that just crushed me. That's good. And up. And there we go. Those are still really difficult. And I noticed when you were starting the game up, there was at the top a, a character select. As you play through, do you get other characters to, to play as? Yeah, yeah, you actually collect characters. That's one of the things with the skulls, that you can collect other characters. Like, I have Commander Video from uh, Bed Trip Runner. I unlocked him. Now, do they do different things? You... Yeah, they have different abilities. Like, one can, like, jump off of walls or something. Or... Yeah. It's different projectiles. Yeah, they have, like... You know, one's got a shotgun and all that other stuff, so... But um But um How much does this game cost on Steam? This game is, uh... Depending... You, you can hardly ever get on sale. But if you're really lucky, you can get it on sale for 10 bucks. That's not a bad price. Which, for the amount of, um... Deaths. <laughs> yeah, I was I was going to say enjoyment, but, um... Well, that death is enjoyment. It, it is a fun game. I mean, I, I give it... I give it a lot of crap, but at the same time, man, is it fun. Oh, yeah, you wouldn't be playing it if it was awful. Yeah. Like pigeon, like pigeon date simulator. Okay, yeah, that that I played once through, and that was just so I could get one of the endings. And I found out that the pigeon that I was going after was a. Um... Did I ever tell you how that ended up? No. It. He was a pigeon that did a midnight shift at a cross-dressing maid cafe because um, 
he was trying to get money for his uh, mom who was sick. Okay. <laughs> yeah, kind of, kind of interesting, but um, at the same time, not at all. <laughs> yeah. I was like, okay, first of all, your pigeons, and and then you're gonna bring that in. Clear, clearly, that game was developed developed in Japan, because that just well, doesn't fly here. No pun intended. Japan, Japan loves that. Oh, oh, wow, wow, dude, that was. Ooh, that was. That was kind of low. <laughs> I don't know. I think it flew pretty well. Again, again, that's just really okay. Go, go, go. Okay, so as soon as I get the skull, I need to shoot. No, okay, I I need to not die there. That would be good. Not dying anywhere is probably the best way, your best course of action. Yeah, I'm thinking that I can't die. Anywhere in this stage, like, and then I'll be okay. Like in that first set of spikes. Yep. That's a terrible place to die. Yep, that is horrendously awful. Actually, I think the worst place to die would probably be like just before that door. Ow. Yeah, it would be. Well, here's here's the thing. You see, I've got to go through. The, I gotta go through the bottom there, which I'm sure one of those blocks has to have a set of spikes. Oh yeah, there's gotta be spikes. If it, you look down it, there, all the jumping ones, somewhere in there. Well, this... This game wouldn't be, you know, what, what it is if there wasn't, you know, a set of spikes there. Yeah. And by the way, there are way more than a thousand and one spikes in this game. Yes. I think each level has a thousand one spikes. Yeah. Which I'd feel better if I knew that that was the case. Oh god. Oh god. Oh! Okay. You can do it! Come on. I don't know, I, I could forgo the skull, but, man, I really no, no. I, I want it. I want it. Now, do you get 1,001 lives per level, or just for the whole game? For the whole game. That's rough. Yep. Scorpions, for the first time, got me. Oh, God. Whenever I see scorpions in a game, especially like when they're 8-bit like this, I always think of uh, oh, the old Atari game where you'd have to run around and there's the scorpions. Pitfall. Oh, Pitfall, yeah. Pitfall was the shit. Nope, get down there. Nope, nope. My friend Will has a uh, fully functioning Atari. Oh god. We are playing it the other night with Pac-Man, it was a lot of fun. Okay, alright. Oh shit! Yep, yep, so, um, you know that theory? Where there was, um... Spikes? There were spikes? Uh-huh. Yep. That... Happened. Yep, it sure did. I should have known better. I was waiting for it too. That's what yeah, the problem I saw. was. I was, there. I was freaking waiting for it. I was like, I know they're coming. I know you're freaking doing this. And yeah, I did it anyways. Because math. Up, and up. I, 
think the way you did it last time, where you let that the, the block fall, then you went back up to get the skull. I think that's a, a safer method. Yeah, I rather think try so and do too. it all one go. Yeah, because that way you can better time with those rotating spike things, the little shurikens. Nope. Yeah, I gotta work on my timing a little bit on that. Now, there are people that actually speedrun this game. <laughs> it <just laughs> boggles my mind. I mean, I think it's awesome. I, I think it's amazing that they're able to do it. And oh, I'll yeah. give them all the props in the world. For Oh my god, I didn't duck there. Oh, now I went back a little tiny ways because I was afraid of getting crushed on the other side. Oh, so I can just run into it, and then... Uh, well, that's a little handy tip there. So this game's really about learning. See, I screwed that one up, but I did get a skull, so that was a free, that was a free attempt. All right, so I won't die there again, more than likely, unless I get crushed by the first one, or I missed, them, which is entirely possible. So many different ways to die. Oh, yeah. Okay. So let that guy go. And there's that one. Oh my god, this is going to be brutal. We'll jump. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Oh no. No. Why? I can't wait to see. Uh. <laughs> uh. Like, I knew it was wrong. I knew it was wrong going into it, but I did it anyways. It's just rough. It, it's brutal, man. I'm telling you, this game is freaking brutal. Okay. Well. <laughs> nope. 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 Okay. All right. Oh, God. No. Nope. Rick. Okay, that's one. And off to the races. I wonder if anybody's ever died in that covered pit before the scorpions with the three blocks. 
Because it seems oh. pretty obvious that how to avoid that. Yeah. Well, I'm sure... With... I'm sure somebody's figured that out. Well, somebody's died there at some point. The problem is I'm not as confident as I need to be on the strategy here. Okay, so if I go... Oh my god. Should have just fallen back down and I would have been fine. Up. Up. Okay. Up. Yeah, you gotta make better use of your ability to you know send those back in the way they're coming. Hit him with your daggers. Well, either that or just time it better. That's the thing. That too, yeah. Okay, up and go. A little bit. And a lot bit. And a little bit. And a lot bit. Oh! God. Did you do it again? Well, ish. You'll see. Uh, yep. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, so you cannot be on that thing when it comes up. Nope. Period. Scorpion got me again. Jeez. Do that. Up. Up. Yep. A little bit. And there we go. Lot. There it is. <clears throat> okay. Squish. Okay, I knew I was gonna do that. Why didn't I? No. Yep. Again, I know it's coming. That's the problem. It's so easy to forget the, the small little traps because you're thinking about the end game, you know? Oh, yeah, you're just thinking about this, you know. How to get the okay. skull, or, or you're thinking how, about how, how, to, how to return with the key, and you forget, oh, that little set of spikes yeah. right there. Nope. Okay, bad. Up, okay, and there. Big, little, big. Shit. Took me for the ride. Your footing, you gotta watch where you're letting your feet go. Yep. I'm getting hungry. Time that better. 
You getting hungry? Yeah. I'm trying to think what I want for dinner. Hungry like hungry man hungry. I'm always hungry man hungry. Get a hungry man TV dinner. So Epic Meal Time has this uh, show called Handle It. Okay. And they have the best looking stuff on there. Well, it is Epic Meal Time. It's kind of their thing. Well, like some of the stuff that they make, like I would seriously not eat ever. I don't know. I I try it all. Um, they actually show you how to make a bacon wrapped deep dish pizza. Yeah, I I, I think the that's a thing now at uh, Domino's or Little Caesar. Little Caesars has it. Well, and I don't like Little Caesars. And I think the reason I don't like them is because I never get them fresh. Well, um, Josephine and I went and got one of them fresh. And it was, like, really freaking good. Well, yeah, they now have that always ready, you know, five-minute pizza. Yeah, but the problem is that they're sitting there for a while. Hmm. You know what I mean? Like, they're well, always I, ready, but they're sitting there. There's no Little Caesars in Lockport, so I don't ever get a chance to go there. I just see their commercials. Pizza time! It's pizza time. Ha! <laughs> Yay. I went poopy on the pizza. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah! Fuck. Yes. That time, I just let myself go. I knew there was going to be a spike there. I knew there was going to be a spike right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And and on your way back too, yeah. not on the way there, right. on your way back. It's like, oh yeah, you got the key. Oh yeah, here's here's another set of spikes for you. Because we haven't dicked you around enough. Oh my god. Well, I think I got. One more to go before the, uh, actually, let me, let me go to the world map here. Nope, two more to go before the, uh, good, good map, or the, the good, good end here. Hmm. I got eight o'clock. I, I still got some time. Oh, yeah, you got plenty of time. I still got time. So, seriously, it's only eight o'clock? Yeah. I've only been playing for an hour? Yeah. Wow. Is that showing up online? No, it's not. It's not showing up on my feed. That's cool. What the heck? I might be able to make it through... Uh, the water section here. Water section, yeah. It looks like you got fire coming up next, and then whatever that purple is, and then a gold one at the end. Right. There's a lot of levels. Yep. Yeah, it is. Stage 3.4, go left. Yep. Go left. So let's let's tally this up here because um now we got the uh no, that's my D three. Well I hate to write on the back of something that can't well my calculator right here, so I'll do that. What what have I got here? I got I got a text message. Um oh forward. Okay, you can join me on Twitter. Oh, great. Thanks. Thanks, uh, Jeffrey. That That's fantastic. Um, by the way, um, I had a couple of uh, people on Skype that wanted to uh, be my friend. I think one of them was like some sort of like Soapy Suds 657. 
Yeah, I get those uh, at least once a week. Some fake name, you know, Buxom hey. Bambi. Hey, you there? Yeah, exactly. I just declined request and leave. All right, so I died 26 times on 1,001 spikes. Um, first one. So 3 2 uh, is 14. I did pretty good on that one. Do I die 14 times? Yeah. 55 on stage 3. So I've died 95 times. <laughs> so I, I could, uh, I could theoretically wind up beating, uh, Beating my estimate. That's always a good. But thing. I still, I still have two stages to go. So true, and they only get harder. So yeah. Well, you know they they pepper in like a, an easy stage every once in a while just to kind of give you a break and a confidence boost. Like, hey, that wasn't that bad. I'm actually pretty good at this game. Spikes in the butt. So, so this character's name is uh, Aben Hawkins. Aben Hawkins, yep. Okay, short jump and short jump. Nope, that that wasn't good. Okay. Nope, that's not good. Either. They want to get shot by the uh, flying daggers. That's you didn't get to the spikes yet. You're just poison tip darts here. Now, if old Aben was a smart fella, he would, you know, take the top off that box at the beginning, use it as a shield. Yeah, but he's not. No, he's an idiot. He just busts he, things up like a he's like actually Neanderthal. kind of a he. He's actually kind of a dick. Is he? Yeah. Like his his father is kind of a dick too, but. Oh, there's a storyline involved. Oh my God. Okay, I see skull is now. Does everybody else see where the skull is? <laughs> yes. I, I saw it since the beginning. I don't know how you're supposed to get up all the way there, but... I did not. Oh, God. Oh, God. 